بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ہیلو گائز ویلکم ٹو مائی چینل ان دس سی شاپ جی یو آئی ٹوٹوریل وی آر گوئنگ ٹو لرن اباؤٹ لیس ویو کنٹرول ان سی شاپ سو لیس سٹارٹ فرسٹ آئی ول گو ٹو ٹول باکس اینڈ ڈریگ ان سم بٹن بٹن اینڈ آئی ول ڈریگ اٹ نا آئی ول ڈبلیکیٹ اٹ بائی کلکنگ کنٹرول اینڈ ڈریگ اٹ ڈاؤن اینڈ ادر ون and now another one here and one other here now I will arrange them a bit and now I will add in a list view now this is list view so I'll add it here and now I will expand it now I will change the names of these buttons so at this first one will be uh, add btn and under text will be add and now this one will become delete or I'll make this uh, capital delete and now the name will become uh, del button and now this one will be hmm, count btn and now the text will be um, count and now here this will become clear so with this we will clear this list view and I will keep make this uh, capital and now I'll come to this and change the name of this button this clear button so this will be clear btn and now I'll make this exit btn and now I'll make this exit the text and now I'll make change the name of this list view to uh, list view underscore records now I will click double click on this uh, add button and now we will add some item means to this uh, list view so list view underscore record dot dot add not add dot items dot add and now I will add an item into it so I will add my name Mudassir and I will put semicolon here and now if I run this Now if I click on this add button, you can see that this is added, Mudassar is added into this. But first we need to add uh, some column into this list view. So for that I will close this and now uh, I will go to design and I will click on this. And now I will click on this edit column and now uh, I will add uh, three column into it. So uh, the first one. I will name this uh, the text I will change to name the second one I will change to the text to father name
and the third one I will change to uh, address and I will click OK and now if I run this application now you can see I have added the columns uh, name but it is not showing here so I will close it down and I will click on this uh, icon and now I will come here if this large icon small icon list or tile is selected it will not show and if I select this detail you can see it will be shown here now I can edit these columns and now I can change the width of these columns from here I will make this uh, first one a hundred and uh, the second column I will make it uh, one hundred as well and the third column I'll make it uh, 150 and now I'll click OK now if I run this now you can see the columns at the top and now if I click on this you can see I can add only name so I have to add this father name and address so that there we will use less items so I'll double click on this button now here I will go to this top and uh, inside this curly brace I will use list view uh, item this one uh, lv um, item equals new list uh, view item and here I can add my name and semicolon and now this list view item has mm, sub items so I will add a sub item and here I will add my, fa uh, my father name and uh, here I have to use the dot add and now I will put semicolon here and now here I can add another sub item dot sub item dot add and here I can uh, enter my address uh, uh, Peshawar Pakistan and now I'll put semicolon here now I will remove this uh, my name from this and I will add LV um, item here and now if I run this application now if I click this add you can see my name my father name and my address is added and if I click again it will add per each click now I will make another item I will copy this and I will paste it here and I will make this a name Asad and uh, his name is father name will be Gul and his address is the same and I will make this to LV item uh, 2 I'll make this 2 as well I have to stop this uh, I, this will become 2 this will also 2 and now here I will add the 2 item now if I run this application and now if I click on this add uh, button it will add uh, two items at a time now I'll go again to design and now we will delete the item from this uh, uh, list view now here we will write um, list view record dot uh, items dot uh, remove and then um, list view record dot selected uh, item items used uh, we use items for multiple so we will use the zero the item selected at zero because we select only one item so that is zero index now if I run this application and now if I add a few records and now if I select this this record so the whole uh, 
uh, row is not selected only the first item uh, is selected first column so let me fix this I will close this application and now I'll go to design and click on this and now here I will go to I will go to this uh, full row select is false so I'll make it true uh, by clicking on this true now if I run this application and now if I add a few items and now if I select this and now if I click delete you can see it is removed now if I click this last one and delete it is removed from the list view now we will count all the items that are added into this uh, uh, list view and show it in a message box so I will double click on this uh, uh, button now here I will declare a int variable count and now I'll uh, assign this count to um, um, list view record dot items dot count semicolon and now message box dot show and now here I will use total records equals plus uh, count and now I'll put semicolon here and now if I run this application and now if I click on this count you can see the total records are zero and now if I add some and now if I click on this you can see records are 10 and now if I add some more count now it is 24 now we will implement this button clear button we will remove all the records at one click so I'll come to this double click on this and now here I will use list view record dot items dot clear and semicolon so we only need this now if I run this application and now if I add some items into this uh, some record into this list view and if I click this clear it will clear the whole list view now um, if there is no item and if I click this delete button you will see that it will throw an exception it has uh, thrown this exception so let me fix this now here I will use F um, list view record I have to stop this first now if list view record dot selected items dot count is greater than zero then delete this records and else show a message uh, message box dot show and here we will show the message please select a record first and now I will put semicolon and now if I run this and if no record is selected and if I click on this uh, button delete button you can see that it will it is telling us that we select a record now if I add and now no record is selected it will also uh, tell us the same message or show us the same message now if I click this and delete this it will delete it now we will implement this exit button so I'll go to design quickly design and now I'll double click on this uh, exit button and now here we will use application dot exit and now I'll put a semicolon here and now if I run this application and now if I click on this exit button the application will exit so that's all for today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you